Next, 12 o'clock high in color. I hope this is the contact I've been waiting for. Yes, sir. <laughs> no, they didn't put his picture in. That scowl of his may have broken the camera. It just says, Colonel Harry Connolly recommended for the Congressional Medal of Honor and uh, a story about Italy. No, he's still a colonel, I guess. Yeah, he's somewhere in London, hiding. He hates publicity. Ken, come here, please. Joe, I've got to go. Sir? What is it, sir? lost him, sir. He didn't sign off, did he? No, sir. I think they cut him off. Like they did when they caught up with that guy yesterday afternoon. Well, at least he was able to pinpoint the target. What's it all about, sir? Sit down, gentlemen. Ken, what do you know about this atomic research that's going on? I read about it. It'll over my head. Hanging over all of our heads right now. Allied intelligence sources confirm the fact that the Germans are very close to figuring out a way to harness this energy. Atomic energy. Build it into a bomb. The super bomb. I've heard rumors. A single one would be sufficient to wipe out London. We finally got a fix on the hideout where all the scientific brain work is going on. Edelberg, a little village. But at least two British spies have died there confirming the location. Can we bomb it? Oh, yes, we'll have to bomb it. I don't know how, but I do know it'll take the best men we can find, and they'll be accused of murder if they survive. Murder? Killing helpless allies and friends. Murder, yes. 12 o'clock high. A QM production. Starring Paul Burke. Also starring... Chris Robinson, and Frank Overton, with guest stars James Whitmore, Andrew Duggan, Joe Maross. Tonight's episode, The Ace.